My students, here Julian Kepok incident is mentioned as yes, this has a newspaper report. See the newspaper report in your activity 4 in the textbook. Outright news report. It is very important in your examination. You should learn it, okay? Right. So what is the needed is headlines, byline, deadline, late, body, body, court. Everything is here. This is the best way of writing newspaper report. So you must be right this date everything is there okay as today i would like to introduce a new poem in front of you on killing a tree on killing a tree written by gb patel that means indian writer we want to know gb patel born on 8th in august 1940 is still alive this indian poet playwright painter and physician he is a part of Green Movement, which is involved in effort to protect this environment. Oh, he belongs to environmentalist. Environmentalist, okay. A great uh, love for nature. His poem exposed man's cruelty to nature. Yes, this poem also exposed what he said, man's cruelty to nature. His books include poems like "How Do You Withstand," "Body," "Mirrored Mo Mirroring." And three plays titled Princess and Savaska and Mr. Bahram. So, a versatile genius as a painter, physician, and a playwright and poet. Versatile genius, Kibi Patel, Indian poet. So, she says about the poem Expose Man's Cruelty to Nature. How man became very cruel against nature. So, how man can make Cruelty. See this. Okay, you see this picture. By killing a tree, it is a man cruelty, according to po poet, because poet is natural lover. So this poem again is the. Uh, what is it? Uh, it says it's poem says about the preservance of nature, the importance of nature, without nature, without us. Okay. We can't live without nature, right? So this is the importance of nature on killing a tree. Here is how a man or people can kill a tree. How it is. That means it's a negative way to say that. That means actually he said it. Don't kill a tree. Don't cut a tree. Don't deforestation. Everything is saying in this line. Because he's a great supporter of nature. Okay. On killing a tree. Here is before we have read the story. A story of Julian Capoc, the sole survivor of the plane, plane crash. Even nature plants the survival in spite of adversity. Let us read a poem. Okay. It takes much time to kill a tree. Yes, kill a tree means here destroy a tree, destroy a nature. Yeah, not a simple job of the knife. If we can use a knife and we can cut a tree, it is not a big job as uh, other concerns. We'll do it. We can do it. It has grown. Again it has grown. If you cut the plant, it comes out again. Slowly consuming the earth. Yes, it just comes from the earth, no? Rising out it. It comes from and rising, growing out it. Feeding, yes, it is eating upon the upon its crust. Crust means uh, what's cover. Absorbing years of sunlight, yes, that is the food of tree, sunlight, air, water, and out of its leprous hide, that means color colorless hide, sprouting leaves, and its leaves are sometimes its color, uh, which didn't get more color. But if you get it more air, more water, more sunlight, it is flourished very nicely. It is to become colorful and energetic. That is, is the says about the poet in this first stanza. That means it is it is very easy to killing a tree, but it is not a easy. But uh, sometimes it is maybe very tough. Sometimes it is very easy. Here is that it is not easy to killing a tree. That means if you take a knife and. Uh, in the middle, maybe cut this plant 
uh, that may be very easy but it is again it will come up how slowly consuming that rising out of it feeding upon the crust absorbing years of sunlight air water and out of its leprosyde sporting leaves leaves means you know yes so these things as will come out that means it is not easy job to killing a tree you think that you can cut it with a knife but it is not easy job it will comes again because it is a uh, root is uh, deep into the earth we didn't cut that root so that's why it is comes again with the help of sunlight air water and it kind uh, of comes into colorful leaves and it is spread down spread the leaves are spreading spotty spotting means spread leaves right so hack and chop hack and chop means cut same meaning as the hack means uh, pulled out and chop cut but this alone want to do it not so much pain will do it the bleeding bark will be heal heal means uh, recover and from close to the ground will rise curl the green tink twigs miniature boughs which is unchecked will expand again to form a size that means if you want to cut this tree you don't cut with the knife you should have to comes in a different way how it is a way so hack can chop you should have to pull it out and cut this piece cut the piece but this alone won't to do it if you cut the piece is not uh, not at all it will comes maybe growing not much this pain will do it the bleeding bark maybe it is comes bleeding similar like the man's wounds bleeding what it will be heal it will be overcome it will be uh, what is it recover and it again comes out and form close to the ground because it's a close to the ground will rise curled green ticks green curled green ticks means here variegal yeah miniature boss boss means shagal which is unchecked will expand again to form a size that means if you not cut this uh, with uh, this way it will be comes again it is grow again which is growing again it means here the tree okay so what is next no the root is to be pulled out out of the anchoring earth yes you should have to pull the root then only it will be destroyed pull the root of this uh tree connected to earth it is to be roped yes tied yes it should be roped means to be used uh, by the rope and to pulled out tied it the uh, tree and pulled out snapped out snapped out means it should be take other place or pulled out entirely not in that place pulled out to other place out from the earth cave yes earth cave means earth, that means a deep root of the earth and the strength of the tree exports strength and the strength of the tree is exports then only we can what destroy the tree destroy the nature how it is come the root is to be pulled out root means the very as in the marathin okay out of the anchoring earth anchoring earth which is connected to earth you know yeah spread it earth and it is to be rope it here means a uh, tree rope would mean used to rope uh have you ever seen the uh, to cut the tree have you ever seen the tree is uh, cut by using the rope so many people are comes and uh, tied the trees with a big rope and pulled out that is incident here occurs snap out pulled out entirely which is here pulled out that means tree out of from the earth cave yes and the strength of the tree exposed Okay. Then the source white and wet. You know the deep root of this uh, tree is that white and wet. Wet means none. That means the root of the tree. How the root of the tree is situated? White and <coughs> sorry, white and wet. The most sensitive, hidden for years inside the earth. Just 
that means hidden inside the earth you know the root of the tree then the matter of scorching and choking in sun and air that means so scorching means it's a uh, it drink more water and after that it is choking in sun and air browning yes after that what happened you you should have to uh, cut this roots the white and the wet root uh, hidden for more in say there after what happened you should be scorching and choking that means you should have to use it in the sunlight and air avoid it on the sunlight and air and it became later it became browning that means the tree became browning and hardening very thickening that means its, its smoothness will go on testing as uh, withering that means uh, different we can use in uh, lost the shape of the tree dead the shape of the tree here mentioned testing and withering and then it is done then is that is the uh, last side of the tree that is the death of the sea here mentioned we can give this way only from no from the onwards we can uh, we will do for the i mean we will do for this what is the killing of a tree is do this two stands i mean two stands as is very important for how we can kill a tree this is only possible to kill a tree otherwise it is not possible that means see here see, see the root of this uh, tree and it pulled out now here the picture is there uh, and after cut it is that cut it is again it will come and grow see that yes and it you should have to do what is that you must be here is do that how to kill that one you must be uh, what is a root is to be pulled out out of the anchoring earth it is to be roped tied and pulled out snapped out or pulled out entirely that means pulled out to some other place is not there out from the earth cave and the strength of the tree exposed then we can understood the strength of the tree and it is now dead and the source why uh, that means source white and wet that is here says about the root of this uh, if you want to kill you want to take the root of the tree then only we can kill that one if you have cut in the middle we can't kill the tree the source white and wet the most sensitive hidden for years inside the earth then the matter of scorching and choking okay in in sun and air browning and hardening twisting and uh, withering and then it is done yes then only we can uh, kill the tree that's how it is this is okay here is that uh, how to kill a tree is said that actually the poet doesn't want to kill the tree but he uh, says the message is that if you want to kill you can kill a tree but not in the way of a knife or uh, other equipment if you want to kill it's a very technically you you want to kill the tree otherwise it's not possible it's not easy job because for a long years uh, trees i mean its root is very deep into the earth it is very difficult to kill a tree if it is killed it will again comes out if it is very technically killed then our neck the tree will now come out so here is his uh, emphasis in the message is that what is that we don't want to disturb a plant if you don't want to disturb a tree it will be destroy our nature the plants and trees are asset of our society asset of our new generation asset of our um, our world in order to sustain in order to lead a better life we want need we want the importance of we want to have the importance of nature so don't cut a tree don't kill a tree according to gv patel here says about because he is a natural lover and also is environmentalist and at the same time he is gave emphasis for the importance of nature so that is why uh, he is mockingly say that killing a tree it is first of all you think that is easy job but actually if you want to killing a tree it is a very tough job that means if you killing a tree means you have to kill our society our nature our world itself that is also he says in the meaning really okay anyway it is a very interesting and uh, and things as to here she says that i will say about one small this on killing a tree it take it means tree takes much time to kill a tree not a simple jab of the knife knife you know will do it it has grown if you cut the simply 
it is it is not uh, enough for to kill it is uh, it come again grown how slowly consuming the earth rising out of it feeding upon crust absorbing years of sunlight air water and out of its leprous hide sprouts leaves it again comes out with the leaves and plants It's too much things is feeding yes and it's its crust also comes out totally okay so hack and chop maybe you can hack and chop but this alone want to do it if you chop or hack it will again comes out not so much pain will do it yes the breeding bark will be that means if you cut that one if there comes a bleed and it will again comes out and heal it heal it mean recover the wound okay recover the ailment here ailment mean cut okay and from close to the ground will rise curled green pinks miniature boughs which we which if unchecked will expand again to form a size yes if you just don't care to cut it will come again and if it will spread out just like a form a tree so it is not easy job to kill that one if you want to kill you want to use a separate way of killing that is here mocking way said by gb patel then how we want to, how how can we kill that tree actually this is two stanza says about last two stanza says about the method of killing according to gb patel how that one no the root is to be pulled out yes first we want to root we want to pull out root is very important that is a very important part of a tree we want to pull out what root then only we can kill the tree out of the anchoring earth yes it is to be roped yes we want to use rope tied it and pulled out snap out or pulled out entirely from the place out of from the earth cave and is cave take from the connection want to take from the earth that means we want to cut the roots perfectly then only we can we want to uh, we can kill or we want to destroy the what tree okay so out of the earth caves and the stems of the tree exposed okay then after after it been pulled out what happened if a tree is pulled out okay then we want to what uh, we can see what is that white and wet source that means its root is to be white and wet we can see the a uh, muddy root that be white and wet color the most sensitive hidden for years inside the earth yes long years it is connected with her hidden i mean secretly under the earth okay then the matter of scorching and choking after it became uh, pulled down it will be automatically on the sunlight it will be scorching and choking and the sunlight and the air after separated from the root from earth it became choking and scor- uh, scorching due to sunlight and air and after its color may be fade browning that is the way of its death the tree's death is now mentioned here its color is browning hardening its uh, uh, crust is became hardening twisting and withering yes and then it is done here done and it is done mean the death of a tree we are mentioned then only we can say that this is a way only we can destroy that tree you are mentioned by gv patel but nothing more it is uh, the most important thing i already again said is that is key more important for nature we don't even destroy a plant we should have to plant more trees okay or you want to uh, sap the tree sap in the plant okay you want to introduce new plants in different parts of our earth don't destroy uh, no de- don't destroy the nature don't demolish the nature you should have to uh, preserve the nature we want to uh, plant more trees here and there especially in your house here or in any other places with this then only our nature will be flourish then only our nature will become greenery then only our next generation will be survive perfectly and they can let their good life good life they need 
good environment if the good environment is there's too much plants and trees are one more then only we can uh, sustain very perfectly in our beautiful world and uh, killing of tree is very interesting uh, connected to a nature if you are a natural lover it became more effective to you okay anyway the point game message is what is that you should have to allow this uh plant and trees and plant it here and there okay here is so much question is there what can you infer from the word breeding bark breeding bark means what is that cut the tree and and it becomes wounds and the wounds will be healed again it will become out what will happen if the boughs are unchecked boughs are unchecked it will be comes it will be again grow okay what was it done to these root settlers uh, roots may be cut and we can see this wet and uh, white roots we can see that one how does the poet describe the life source of the tree describe the life source of the tree the life source of the tree is here says sir uh, here is this is here the life source of the tree white and wet most sensitive hidden yeah that is the why so so the what do you understand from the title on killing a tree is it to kill a tree just to put a title or answer do you think that they want to kill the tree no we don't industry to kill a tree because tree is very important part of our nature if there is perfect nature we can live a good life okay okay then you want to explain why this what happened if you had to deforestation how it is affects exit the poet parents uh, sorry poet present the tree as a human being just like human being if a human being get accident it will go to hospital and the heal and wounds are recover and come again similarly cut the tree after they is uh, getting oxygen uh, i mean air and water and uh, sunlight it will be grow again so that is a here is a personification that means uh, tree is compared to man human being okay okay right so here personification what is that and out of his separate side means here personification used okay right so here is also some of the words and uh, jab kill is a word words action which is associated with the killing a tree here is a uh, tree's growth is here here death is here so that is also important points you want to know that okay that's a simple nothing more has said okay shall i ask one question did you uh, write your notes book perfectly all activities should fill in this textbook really sure okay then uh what is about uh, this hss live guru from the, the link you can copy the answer okay you should write perfectly otherwise it became more and it is difficult to write so this poems is very interesting is it okay is it any rhyming word rhyme scheme is there see that tree knife grown a b c is there okay there is no proper uh, rhyming word is not here okay so that's also very important thing so, so see the picture of a cutting uh, tree here <coughs> sorry so how the tree will comes and uh, comes to grow again this is the first step. it is supposed to stand as a body if you cut a knife it is not a real death of a tree it will comes out again it will grow similar like that of if we have uh, some kinds of injury or in situation we have went to hospital we will go hospital and we are cure the treat cure by the treatment and come back similarly that is also the tree says here personified says about trees and human being and similarly if you want to kill a human beings very technically we can kill similarly if you want to kill a 
uh, tree, we can technical side we can use and we can kill it. That is here says about that how to kill. No, the two stanzas about how perfectly we can we want to kill it. If you decide we want to kill the tree. But it is not an easy job according to poet. Symbol of knife is not enough. Symbol of word is not enough. We want to use the technical side. Sir. But actually is the poet is interested to kill a tree? Never. Poet never interested to kill a tree. This is a, a reverse message. That means a different message is given by poet. That means we never disturb a tree. We never uh, destroy nature. Okay. If you have to do, if you will, if you will see some other is, uh, will do such kinds of duties, you should have to stop it one and to give, imp give importance to aware them how to the nature became our inseparable part in life. You see, so if you want to killing a tree, according to poet, it is a not good, and he is mocking the people who are killing a tree. And he uses sarcasm, or we can, I can say that is very indirectly he point out someone who those who have killed the trees for their selfish interest or personal interest. Anyway, that is killing a tree is one of the message to the new generations. What is that? You don't to disturb that uh, natural the trees uh, anymore, right? So we want to try to survive. Here Julian Capoc in the last portion survive. Similar like that of, uh, we know the importance of survival. So if you want to survive properly, we want to keep the nature properly, then only we can let a good life easier. Okay. So on killing a tree, that means it's not easy. First paragraph says it's not an easy job. And, and also remembering about the importance of Again, it will be comes out, and uh, it will be the, the second sentence says about the injured tree, how it became injured, how it became healed, how it became recovered, and third and fourth stanza says about how a person can technically, uh, perfectly kill a tree. He says that okay. So this G. V. Patel is not an ordinary man. He is he is give more preference for what nature. That is his natural law, okay? Even though he is an Indian poet, right? He still is loves his nature, right? He was born in 1940, I already told it. He's still living, yeah? A poet, playwright. Playwright means he has drama, right? Okay, painter and a physician. Physician means what? Doctor, yeah. He is a part of green movement. Green movement itself, he says about what is the importance of nature. Green, the natural color, is it? The importance of nature. He belongs to... Green movement. So many people, so many uh, great people are member of the green movement, which is involved in the effort of protect the environment. Yes. What is the aim of this green movement? Protect the environment. Protect the nature. Okay. His poem exposed. His poem mostly exposed the show. Exposed means show about the cruelty to nature. Some of them are used to, to um, uh, show cruelty towards the nature, the destroying the nature. There mean deforestation, and also you are still sand mining, and you also used to use excessive use of plastic, and the vehicle smogs, and the climate changes, global global warming. All these are the harms on our nature. So we want to protect. We want to make sound against that, and we want to protect our nature. And each student should have the, uh, one of the member of the movement, according to the po poet. The poet poem exposed man's cruelty to nature. Yes, this poem also shows the cruelty of nature. What is the cruelty here? Kill. Kill a tree is a cruelty of nature. His works include, some of his works also says about that one. What is it? How do you withstand? And uh, how do you withstand? How do you need to withstand? How do you need to survive? Okay, body. Okay, mirror and mirroring. Okay, and three plays, three dramas. What is the title? The Princess one, Savaska, second drama, third one is Mr. Behram. So these are the three important drama he composed. So G. V. Patel, Indian poet, 
you must know about this okay i think it's a we want to wind up the the killing of tree okay on killing of tree i want to wind up that one okay thank you very much take care